eyes. Okay, so uh, here is my spark line. You can see here it's um, it's conditioned to my D4 cell. Um, here I have the color. Oops, give me a second. This I don't want this to be D4. This is going to be um, where I insert the color, right? So. So if this is one, so I condition that to max of number five. So here, if I do two, it's going there. Three, four, five, that's it, it goes up to five. So, uh, and now I'm going to insert my hex coding here. So I'm going to remove this, which is where the, the hex color uh, would go. And I'm going to insert the D9 cell. And all I gotta do, <clears throat> I come over here and I'm going to select the hex code for this. Uh, so I just clicked in here to, so I can pick up the, the, the actual code, right? So I have this, I just click here on the plus sign now to add a custom color. And I will copy this and I just click okay. And now here you're gonna double click and just enter um, the hex code now you changed um the color for your thing so if you are trying to change the theme here <clears throat> uh it's not gonna work for for this park line with the formula in the cell but this is a way to say you know if you're using this code then you can put uh, i mean if you're using this this theme enter this code in this cell. If you're using that theme, theme number two, enter the hex code. Uh, this, you can give the number. I mean, you don't have to direct them, you know, on how to find the hex code. You can just give me uh, whatever color, hex code color is your theme, the accent, whatever, accent one, two, or three, whatever you're using, like for the header, for example. Uh, you can just say, uh, insert this code. If you're using number two, insert this code. If you use number three, you insert this code. And then, and this will work for any color, really. So I change, I wanna use the pink. I just click the pink and I'm gonna grab the code. And I'm gonna put it here. And you don't have to color this. If you have the hex code already, uh, <clears throat> you can leave this blank. Like this will not uh, change anything. It will not interfere with your formula here. So yeah, so just make sure instead of the, you know, because he, if you wanted to use, see, this is picking up this, the value. Now, if you, because normally I would have this, right? <clears throat> In here. So if you click this and then put this and then this, that's going to do this. And if you wanna change, you know, to yellow, that will, and you put in the formula, this is how it will change. But since you are conditioning that to whatever, see that changes in here. Uh, but now if I enter this, if you put it here and then you leave it empty like this, for example, it will oh, turn, okay, so this, it will, the, it will default to orange, but then once you enter your code here, now it's yellow again. I hope that answers your question.